something that perhaps might have, you know, uh, perhaps touched a nerve. So I posted the next one, and on the next one, I actually said the first was deleted because. Baby, you can call me a superman. Hey yo, what's up everybody? Welcome back to our channel. It's your boy Jesse Keegan and we are Fanny and Jesse. So right about now we're gonna do another reaction video. But before we get into the reaction, guys, I want to thank everybody who's been subscribing to our channel. You guys are really amazing. And the people who've been able to uh, give us reaction videos, you guys are also amazing. And also thank you so much for getting us to 10,400 subscribers. We are really honored and you guys are super amazing. And also, if you're new to this channel, we are Fanny and Jesse. We do a lot of reaction videos. My name is Jesse, my girlfriend's name goes by the name Fanny. And we do different type of reaction videos. Just let us know in the comment section exactly what you want us to do. And we're going to do it for you. And also not forgetting the people who have been giving us good comments. You guys are really amazing. Some informative comments and uh, something to learn. You guys are really amazing. <clears throat> also... Don't forget to subscribe and don't forget to push that notification bell so that you can be the first person to watch whenever we post our videos. So today what we're going to do, we're going to do a reaction video that was suggested by a lot of people. And they, uh, and they decided like, and they suggested that we should go react to Don't Let Social Media Hurt Your Marriage. And this is by Mufti Mank. I hope this is going to be a nice uh, uh, message. And yeah, so without any further ado guys, let's get it. So, when you talk about making your spouse happy, a lot of us put stuff on social media that displeases our spouses. Delete it. It's just a button. And tell them, I did it because you told me that. And you don't even have to comment. If they say, I'm not really happy with this post, tell them, it's gone. Wow. How did it go? It took the second between me saying it's gone, between you saying I'm not happy with it and me saying it's gone. That's all. Do you think that would improve your relationships? Well, ask me. It definitely does. That Allah bless us all. A little while later, I get a cropped up page to say, well, if you really want to post, you can actually post this one. Cropped completely just shows a cup or two. That's it. You can't really see part of your back. And like I said, it's not like the first one was haram, but it's something that perhaps might have, you know, uh, perhaps touched a nerve. So I posted the next one, and on the next one, I actually said the first was deleted because of the request, so at the request of my wife. Whoa. And I thought that was a triple, quadruple reward because number one, you're still fulfilling the issue of encouraging that sunnah. Number two is you deleted it to make your spouse happy. Remember, this is our topic. I'm not off topic by the way. And number three is you actually admit it, no matter what the world thinks of you, that yes, so guys, you know what, I also have a law with me, yeah, exactly. Some of you know what I seven said. Minutes ago. Okay. So, subhanAllah, I, it, it helps. People think I'm a big man, I'm a wealthy man, I'm a dude, I'm a this, I've got so many friends, I've got what, how can I... And some of the youngsters, when they sit, they think, you know what, you're a wife pleaser. What's wrong? There's nothing wrong. My wife is pleased, I'm going to have a happy home, man, subhanAllah. May Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala grant us So I thought I'd start off this way because it's very fresh. This just happened a few days ago. How many of you followed that? Put up your hands. By a large number, mashallah. So it was relevant, alhamdulillah. May Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala bless you guys and may Allah grant us all goodness. I'm not saying it was... It was something grand, but I thought it was worth sharing because people needed to know what exactly happened and why it was done. And I would do it a million times, meaning I would delete anything and everything if it really meant, and I know I trust my family enough, they wouldn't just tell me to delete something just like that. You know, it's not like some of the men, they say, stand, sit, stand, sit, stand. You're supposed to be listening to me, I'm your husband. Stand, sit, stand, sit is, is an insult, man. It's a total insult. Audhu Billah. What are you talking about? Wow, that was a short video and probably the message was also amazing. So, I mean, Dr. Uh, sorry, I mean, um, move to Mank is just pretty much talking about social media. And uh, I said, like, don't let social media hurt your marriage. Um, I mean, this, this has been common in the society today because... Uh, we have social media at our disposal like we have it just on our hands on our cell phones 
and we tend to go in there and uh, scroll down and try to find uh, what pleases our eyes sometimes you get it you know um, there's reached a point whereby you can you can um, you can use social media to do a lot of things you, you can use your cell phone to do a lot of things I mean uh, back in those days uh, not only back in those days I mean today you can try to gaze down and not look at somebody's um, or not look at another lady or something like that but you can go to social media and actually just get everything that probably you need and this is so disturbing because I think it's ruining a lot of uh, a lot of relationships because you can imagine a husband trying to go to social media to just go and look at somebody's picture or maybe try to post something that is not pleasing and on the other hand the wife doesn't really like the idea and stuff like that so it actually creates conflicts between uh, two people or uh, two people who are in marriage uh, or two people who love each other dearly I think social media should be a tool to make you a better person in terms of if you have anything positive that you're doing in the social media but if you have nothing positive the only thing you do is just go in there and try to uh, feed yourself with bad energy that is going to ruin your your relationship or ruin your marriage or whatnot I think that's a bad idea I feel so social media has actually contributed to a lot of breakups a lot of um, uh, ruined relationships I mean so much I mean if people just understand what social media is and they have their own principles and they have their own levels I don't think they'll be able to go there and um, unplease the other partner on the other side this is a really good message and to be honest with you guys social media is actually ruining a lot of relationship it's 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 not making it's it's, it's not trying to create uh, more relationships it's just doing the opposite I mean there's too much going on in there you get it once you have a social media some people even become so addictive some people even I think when you get into that uh, it doesn't matter whether you're in a relationship whether you're in a marriage you shouldn't be able to go and do things that are going to affect your other partner because I mean later on it's gonna create a lot of conflict I think I'm repeating myself now anyway guys if you feel like I reacted to this video in a better way just give me a thumbs up and don't forget to go down in the comment section or our comment section tell us exactly what you feel about this video right here don't let social media hurt your marriage by move to men just let me know in the comment section below what do you think I want to ask a question do you feel social media is bringing more harm in the society than making the society a better environment for people to live I mean in terms of relationship in terms of marriage just let me know in the comment section below and just let me know if you have your personal experience just go down on the comment section below you can just write it down don't feel shy just write it down and we'll be able to look at it we'll be able to actually share one or two things or maybe talk to each other so anyway guys thank you so much and the most important thing guys don't forget to subscribe to our channel the more you keep on subscribing the more you give us the motivation to do a lot of videos and to give you a better better content and last but not the least guys we're going to see you in the next video, or rather I'm going to see you in the next video, and peace out.